While North Korea remains a more pressing security headache for its neighbors in Northeast Asia, its defiance of international calls to rein in its weapons program has set some alarm bells ringing in other parts of the world, particularly in Hawaii, which is geographically closer to North Korea than other parts of the U.S. It's also a key strategic location for the U.S. military. Here's Ron Hamilton for the report. There is caution and concern tonight in Hawaii over North Korea's recent missile test. The United States cautioned on Wednesday, July 5th, it was ready to use force, if need be, to stop North Korea's nuclear missile program, but said it preferred global diplomatic action against Pyongyang for defying world powers by test launching an intercontinental ballistic missile that some experts believe has the range to reach the U.S. states of Alaska and Hawaii and perhaps the U.S. Pacific Northwest. North Korea says the missile could carry a large nuclear warhead. On the Hawaiian island of Oahu, reactions from both residents and tourists in the capital city of Honolulu ranged from concern to cautious confidence that the U.S. could defend against North Korea. Oh, this uneasiness of not knowing what he's capable of doing and the unknown of what he will do and then what, we're, what we will do about it. It was coming eventually and happens to be that guy. And, you know, I call it Armageddon. Armageddon out of here. And um, what you're going to do, you know, when you're, you have a crazy dad, you're going to be a crazy smarter son. And look how much power he has, oh my gosh. The laid-back tourist destination, famous for its warm water and perfect waves, hides a history of steely resolve. As headquarters of the United States Pacific Fleet, Honolulu has long been a target of enemy forces, most famously with the attack on Pearl Harbor by Japan on December 7, 1941, which brought the U.S. into World War II. It was later the spearhead for many military operations during the Korean War and Vietnam War. That's why, you know, it's scary. I was here when they had the Vietnam War, so you had a lot of activities, and it looked like we're getting a lot of activities again, so it's even worse. It's all a push of a button. Boom. <laughs> the missile test is a direct challenge to U.S. President Donald Trump who was vowed to prevent North Korea from developing a missile capable of hitting the United States. Reporting from Honolulu, Hawaii, this is Ron Hamilton for Eagle News. I am one with 25.